Wow! Look at this! I know, I know, hey, I know. Ken Shrell, welcome hey. back. I'm literally standing because they took my they took my literally. chair. Literally. This is uh, a <laughs> If I have to stand, you have to stand. <laughs> I think that's only fair. Say hi, we're on Facebook. Hi. Oh yeah. We Live were... on Facebook right now. Oh, so I still haven't got to do that because I don't run the Miss America Facebook. But oh, okay. I want to do that live thing. Mm -hmm. It's fun. How it's so cool. exhausting is it to be Miss America in a good way? But you know, you're just so with social media what it is nowadays. Oh my gosh. Younger. Wow. It's like 90% of the job, almost. I mean, like, it's I'm every day, you know, you have to because people expect it, you know, and that's how the country keeps up with you. Yeah. So. And she looks absolutely She flawless, does look. Oh, yeah, she really does. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, again, we are live on Facebook, yes. streaming live on Facebook. Don't put up with me. Put up. Um, Miss America, Betty can't tell. <laughs> that's true. No one really wants to see you right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, you know, I must say that we're, uh, we're fellow Georgians. We are. As we say down south, uh, we're kinfolk. Georgia kinfolk, pretty much. Yeah. Um, I'm a New Yorker. I'm sorry. I have no she idea. Like, kinfolk? What? I've never heard that. You've been been Wait, really? Yeah. That's so funny. <laughs> well, you've been traveling so much in the last, it's been six months? Six? Yeah. It's been six months? Yeah. yeah, that's right, yeah. I only have like five months left. Yeah. Wow. Wow. And uh, you've been doing a lot of great work. We've been following you on Twitter mm -hmm. and on Instagram, traveling yep. so much. Yeah. Uh, where Where have you been? What have you been doing since the last time uh, you were here? Uh, I've done a ton. I mean, the since Christmas, basically, I've, my schedule's been jam-packed. I mean, uh, the New Year's brought a lot of new appearances for me. Um, I got to do a USO tour where I got to actually go around the world in eight days um, visiting our deployed troops and uh, actually performing for them. I got to sing for them and um, personally say thank you for their service to our country. So that was really, really amazing, a great opportunity for me. I was chosen by the Joint Chiefs of Joint Chiefs of Staff Vice Chairman wow. um, of the military. So that That's was really cool, cool to yeah. go on the USO tour. So that was amazing. What kind of jet lag are we talking about that? If We're talking 15 hour flights. Um, That's I, fun. My mental clock was like non existent anymore. But luckily, <laughs> my uh, amazing Miss America organization gave me like it. an eight day break I after. Know the tour oh, okay. was over so I could kind of reset before getting back on the road. This is like my first appearance being back on the road again. I'm sure people ask you all the time, on your days off, which are few and far between, mm -hmm. uh, what, what do you do? Are you putting on sweatpants? Are you, you betcha. <laughs> oh yeah, you betcha. Um, I am, that's my North Dakota. Uh, you betcha. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, you betcha. Yeah, so I literally probably gained about 10 pounds on this past like eight days off after the tour because I literally planned my days around where I was going to eat that day. <laughs> so because I had Chick-fil-A at my fingertips, oh, you know, I'm not going to pass that up while I'm in the South. So it was great. <laughs> and, and your hair is different. Than it is. It was last my month. hair is different. A yeah. lot shorter. And there's a, a, a great, great reason why you cut your hair. Yeah. So, um, I actually did it over Christmas. It's grown out a, a bit since I've cut it, but um, I really wanted to kind of give a big like Christmas gift as Miss America. And so I decided I was going to chop off all my hair, which I had never done before, and, um, and donate it to Locks of Love. So uh, it was it was a great Christmas for me. And this is the shortest you've ever had your hair? Oh, yeah. I, I haven't had my hair any shorter than about right here before. So. And and how is that when they were cutting it off? You're looking in the mirror. You are Miss America. <laughs> well, and like yeah. I said, you're, all cameras are on you all the time. And you know, people expect kind of like a pageant girl to have big mm -hmm. flowing hair. Like that's kind of the yeah. thing. And I really kind of also wanted to show people that I'm more than my hair. I'm not just like a pageant girl that, and I need my big hair. Like mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a person and like I, I'm just a normal girl, you know, and I, I kind of wanted to just show that and show that I don't need my hair to be Miss America, you know, some yeah, other, like you know, suffering kid in the hospital can have my hair and, mm -hmm. and you know, feel a little bit better. Excellent point. Well, tell you what, stick around. We're going to uh, play some Ed Sheeran real quick. Can you, can you stay for a couple more minutes? Totally. Because you've been traveling so much and because you just revealed to us that you're terrible at geography. Yay! We're going to do the Mike Show's Geo Pop Quiz. Geography Pop Quiz. We have six geography related questions. And we're going to see, you can play along in your car or at home. We're going to see how Miss America Betty Cantrell does. I think she's got it. Next. I totally got it. Oh, <laughs> very competitive. Next. Good morning.